Hi everyone and a very happy 2021 to you. Now there's a bit of a myth that video must be under three minutes to be effective and whilst it is vital in this day and age that social media content is short and punchy, the overall duration of a video isn't governed by the fact that it is a video but more about what the message and outcomes of the content in the video need to be, what the delivery method of the content is and how viewers will be receiving it. Now, as a general rule, if the content is going to be pushed onto an audience through social media channels and email campaigns, and potentially the viewer wasn't expecting to see that message pop up in their feeds, then absolutely shorty sweet. Think about how we view the social media feeds that we subscribe to. It's generally with a finger ready to delete or swipe left, whichever one is to get rid of it, to skip to the next bit of content rather than carefully digesting everything that pops up in our feeds. If it doesn't grab us instantly, we're not interested. So that also means that you do have to hit the ground running with your message and get straight to the point. So don't start with a lovely 10 second animation to reveal your company logo because the viewers will have moved on by the time the fonts explode or whatever you've chosen. Give it a short, clear message and a clear call to action. Now for content that's pulled in by viewers, such as content you'd find on your website or specific landing pages that they may have clicked on, prompted by social media content, the duration can be longer, but do be mindful that the viewer may well be looking at other competitors' websites. So you want to give them a compelling, engaging story in as short a time as possible and then move to a call to action, such as a form completion, email inquiry, a click to buy, or a phone call. And then finally, for instructional content, well, these videos can be as long as they need to be. If you've promised someone that by clicking on a video link, they'll learn how to install a wooden floor in under an hour, well, that's what your video must deliver. If you miss out vital content just to keep the duration shorter, you'll be misleading the viewer and that will just lead to disappointment. So if it takes 40 minutes to correctly and professionally show how a process works, take 40 minutes. So in summary, know what you're wanting to achieve with your content beforehand, know how it will reach your audience, and then create the content accordingly, and that will determine what the best duration will be. Thanks for watching, and again, best wishes for 2021.